three gin cocktails you've probably never had. At least I haven't. Have you? I have not. I'm Kristen. And I'm Raul. Today we're going to try out a gin swizzle with the Bombay Sapphire. A million dollar cocktail with Hendrix gin. And a New Orleans gin fizz with the Esme gin. Let's get into this. Perfect! High five! Woo! Have you ever had a gin swizzle? Do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Kristen, have you ever had a gin swizzle? Raul, I've never even heard of a gin swizzle. <laughs> well, I maybe I've heard of one. I don't know. But it looks good, and we're going to give it a shot. Try it out. Gin swizzle, what is in it? All right, it is gin, bitters, lime juice, sugar, and it's all shaken together with ice, poured over ice, topped off with club soda, and stirred. Should I try it first? Yeah, All right. yours. Go ahead. Hmm. I'm going to let you taste it with no opinion for me. It smells kind of like flowers. A little bit. I smell flowers. Mm -hmm. well, gin like is gin. Yeah, yeah, flowery, floral. So. Oh. It has a strange taste of <clears throat> nothingness. They all, all the flavors really meld together well, I guess. It's not very sugary, even though it's got a whole um, teaspoon of sugar in the one drink. It does, which I thought was a lot of sugar, but mm -hmm. the sugar's not really coming through. It's very light. It's, it's not sweet. Mm -mm. I mean, if you if you like, you know what? So like, if you've ever had a gin and tonic, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but imagine a gin and tonic, but all the flavors are muted. Yes. Like muted gin and tonic. You can taste yeah. the gin, so it's like almost like tonic is trying to be there. Yeah. But it's and been the bitters squashed. Sort of... It's been squashed. Something that said yeah. tonic, get down. I wonder if this was a drink from before tonic existed. I don't know when tonic was invented. I don't Maybe I don't we'll know. add that fun fact at the end. We'll see. Would you recommend this drink? I would. It is a very nice and light. I don't know. It's okay. If you what like, you if you like gin. I think if you mm -hmm. like gin, you like the flavor of gin. That's, you know, a little spritzy gin with um, kind of a rose, mm -hmm. like a rosy sweetness to it. It's kind of a bitter, rosy sweetness to it. Then yeah, you'll like it. Uh, I don't know if I'd make it again for myself. I don't mm -hmm. think, I don't think I would. I just don't, of all the things that are tasty out there. This is not the this tastiest. This is not the tastiest, yeah. but I'm not gonna let it go to waste. You yeah, will drink absolutely it. Absolutely not, no, we're gonna drink it for sure. You've never been the ones to Turn. waste, <laughs> waste, <laughs> waste, waste anything, out, well. <laughs> much less gin. <laughs> yeah. I have better hopes for the next one. Ah, uh, yeah, me too. Yeah. What is the next one, by the way? Our next one is going to be a million dollar cocktail. How million can you not dollar cocktail. Try a million dollar cocktail. My mom makes a million dollar pie. We'll see if it's and it's similar. really good. And you know what? I think the million dollar pie doesn't have fruit in it. It does. It has uh, pineapple. pineapple. Right? I think it has walnuts Look what's in, in it. This drink. It whipped doesn't have walnuts. It has in the drink, whipped cream but... in it. And this one actually does have pine. Oh, it has pineapple in it as well. Mm -hmm. And well, I think I already said that. And this has egg white. In my mom's million dollar pie. It doesn't have egg white, but it does have cream. Whip. Yeah. So if you whip egg whites, you will have. Isn't it egg whites whipped into a froth? The cream. Whipped cream is made. Meringue. You can make meringue <laughs> out of egg whites. It's just like whipped cream if you add sugar to it, right? <coughs> I suppose so. <laughs> you can tell who does the cooking in our house. <laughs> I'm not a baker. Okay? I'm not a baker. Let's see that. <laughs> All right. On to the next. On to one. the million dollar cocktail. Right okay. on. <laughs> Now 
Next up, we have the Million Dollar Cocktail. This one was my choice, because how can you not try a Million Dollar Cocktail? I'm excited to look at it. Yeah. It's foamy. What's I in mean, it? Um, let's see. In the Million Dollar Cocktail, we have a one and a half ounces of gin, three quarter ounce sweet vermouth, two teaspoons of pineapple juice, one teaspoon of grenadine, and one egg white. Hence the frothiness. Yeah. Which is a meringue, by the way, not whipped cream. Because that's made out of cream. <laughs> now we know. Okay, let's try it out. It smell? Oh, it Does it smell so like million dollar pie? It smells like million dollars. I don't know, I've never smelled million dollars, but mm. I imagine that's what it would smell like. The look on your face doesn't give me confidence that it's delicious. It is good. Try it. Okay. Um, I can't give my opinion. I might sway what you taste. The thing is, it doesn't taste like it looks. So you expect it to be kind of sweet and like a pink flavor, like strawberry or, you know, we, grenadines in it. But it doesn't taste like pineapple. More pineapple no. than anything. Like a floral pineapple drink. Yeah. <laughs> you get I this like... like uh, I always feel weird about these egg white drinks, but. Well, first thing I get is that kind of um, gin, mm -hmm. obviously, on the tongue, and then uh, it's creamy, definitely creamy. And then, um, yeah, like a, like a light, frothy, strawberry cream drink. Yeah, I don't is get that? any like strawberry-ish, like pineapple-y. Uh, pineapple, cream, yeah, yeah, pineapple. I guess a grenadine, cherry. which has like cherry in it. Maybe that with the pineapple kind of yeah. gives it more like a strawberry to me, but. Um, it's, it tastes more pineapple than you would expect. Which one do you like There's better? only two teaspoons of pineapple juice in here. It's kind of the amazing thing. <clears throat> you like this one better than the um, So far, I like this one better, I think. Um, depends on what you're going hmm. for. Maybe this is the other why one's these a drinks more... aren't famous because they're not like... Because <laughs> they're not that good. <laughs> That's why no one's drinking them. That's why you've never, yeah, heard, of it, why like, you've never yeah, heard of it. It kind of yeah, died uh, off with its flavor. Yeah. No, not... Um, <laughs> it's not a French 75. You know, it, it depends on what you like. If, you, if you're <laughs> looking for like that spritzy, um, you know, spritzy refreshing flavor, I would mm -hmm. go for the uh, Chin Swizzle. It's much more. But if you're looking for something a little creamy, mouthfeel, a little more mouthfeel and just... Mm -hmm. um, a little more fruity, I'd go for this one. Yeah, we shook it for a solid good, 30, 45 seconds. Yeah, we seconds, tried to get so. some super froth out of this. And look, it's yeah. still it's holding a froth. Yeah. You know, I'm sure that's you're getting kind of blurry now, but hey. Separating only just a little bit. Just a so little that's bit, not, yeah. Not bad. Yeah. And it the, looks really pretty in this cup. It does. It looks really this glass. Good choice on the cup, by the way. Mm -hmm. Or glass, by the way. Yeah. We literally had to decide what we were going to serve it in. Mm -hmm. And I think this worked out really well. Just calls for a cocktail glass. So just so you know, the next drink called the New Orleans New Orleans Gin Fizz. New Orleans? New Orleans. How do you say it? Oh, Orleans. New Orleans. I, I, yeah. Orleans, yeah. I don't think anyone... I don't know. If you're from New Orleans, do you say New Orleans or you say New Orleans? We say New Orleans. We're from Texas. We're from Texas, so New Orleans? Anyways, the New Orleans Gin Fizz has egg white, so it'll be frothy, meringue, and... <laughs> It actually does have a little bit of heavy cream, so we'll be making meringue and whipped cream at the same time. <laughs> I feel like you're getting obsessed with meringue and whipped cream. <laughs> All right. At this point, we're just a video. We're just making a video of watch people watching us drink alcohol. <laughs> it can be fun sometimes. I was gonna no, it's tasty. It. Not bad. Yeah. All right. On to the next one, the New Orleans Gin Fizz or New Orleans Gin Fizz, wherever, whatever you say. Mm -hmm. Oh, froth, yeah. Interesting, <laughs> the frothy even tastes kind of gin. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Not bad. Not All right. bad. I I would probably have that one again, I think. <clears throat> yeah, I think so. Maybe, too. yeah. Okay. All right. Gin Fizz, your choice. All I'm right. Not gonna lie, this one. I'm, I'm most excited about this one. I mean, 
We were cool. so excited about it. We haven't smelled it. Kind of got well. Oh, I got a little like... whiff, but from a from a, a distance, so mm. that doesn't count. All that right. Doesn't count. I wasn't right up in there smelling it. Yeah. But it does look pretty good. It's got all these things that I think are going to be delicious. I think mm. they're going to work well together. So. Yeah, it's got orange flower water in it, and we did smell that because we've never used orange flower water before. It's like perfume it's in a bottle. Smell. Yeah. Yeah. But not sweet. It was just delicious. Mm. Smells good. Not saying anything, but you have your own little opinion there. Oh, wow. I like this one a lot. It's like lemonade. It is like lemonade. It's like lemonade. That is so good. And the weird thing is, it's not creamy. It's got, but it only has, what is that? One teaspoon of heavy I mean, cream. If anything, it's a little drying on the tongue. Mm -hmm. Not, not really that creamy. It's just good. Hmm. Yeah. I was trying to get some of the foam. Okay, this one is by far. Yeah. By my far favorite. my favorite. Mm, this is the million dollar cocktail. Yeah. One hundred percent would recommend this one. I don't it know why is, they don't make it. This should be a famous drink. Yeah, it's lemony. I mean, it does take quite a few steps. Maybe that's why people don't like making it. I don't know. It mm. disappeared. I've never heard of it. Um, but it's really good. Literally mm -hmm. like drinking lemonade. I mean, the gin but, is there, but it, it just kind of it's works. It's not too tart. No, it's, it's not, not too, too tart. It's sugary. It's not too anything. Yeah. It's really good. If you like All lemonade, right. <laughs> this is the drink for you. <laughs> um, All right. So one, two, and three. The Gin Fizz, the Million Dollar Cocktail, and the Gin Swizzle. Um, number three, I'm going to say the Gin Swizzle. I think number three, I'm going to go with the Gin Cocktail. Okay. So yeah. we're, we're flip-flopping. Yeah. So number two, I'm going to go with the Million Dollar Cocktail. Gin Swizzle. Gin Swizzle. And then our unanimous number one is the New Orleans, Orleans Gin, Gin Fizz. Fizz. Um, yeah, it's really good. It's a winner. Make it. Uh, you will not be... Unless you don't like lemonade, <laughs> then don't make it. But if you like lemonade, like it's lemonade. a Who doesn't like lemonade? Yeah. So... Anyways, guys, that's all we have for you today. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.